Sweden's size and considerable distance between north and south have shaped it into a country of great diversity in its regions, culture and landscapes. This trail is located in the province of Ostriotland, the second largest county in Sweden. These traditional red houses are something you will often see in Swedish nature. The red color, known as Faldurada, helps the wood to breathe and release moisture quickly. This hiking trail is real Swedish in every sense of the word. Incredibly beautiful landscapes, frozen lakes, small islands with houses like from fairy tales. All that and much more for a day or two of hiking. Although the ice on the lake was thick enough to walk to this island without any problems, I simply wasn't that brave. The trail continued to lead me through an enchanting forest that at times seemed a bit eerie. This boat looked like it hadn't sailed for a long time, but it had a purpose on the shore. It gave soul and heart to this frozen landscape. Thank you. 
The view of the lake and its surroundings from this place was anything but ordinary, simply nature at its best. The last part of the trail was fantastic. The streams and the sound of the birds were in perfect harmony. I made my favorite mushroom soup at the end of this dense forest. The view was simply powerful and yet mesmerizing. how sophisticated you may be, a large granite mountain cannot be denied. It speaks in silence to the very core of your being. <laughs> 